welcome back to Budget Beauty Buys. Oh my gosh, I am so excited to be filming this week. I feel like I say that every week, but this week I am doubly excited because last week I didn't really have an episode. I kind of skipped a week, which never happens. I don't think I've missed a week. I can't remember the last time I've missed a week of Budget Beauty Buys. I always, always film it. But I was away with my family. You guys know I talked about it a little bit on um, my last video and my Instagram. And um, yeah, sometimes you just need to take a week break. And I never go away on vacation or anything. So it was so much fun. But I am back and I'm very excited to be filming again. And I really wanted to like film Budget Beauty Buys when I was in North Carolina, but I didn't have a car and I couldn't get to the store. So I had to kind of scratch that. But I am here filming today. I'm at TJ Maxx, number one. I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna split this filming up into two days because I do have a party to go to later today. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to film everything today, but no matter what, you guys are gonna get a good episode like always and I want to see what they have at the stores this week I'm so excited because I missed that last week I feel like there might be a lot of new stuff so I am very hopeful that we're gonna find some new stuff this week and hopefully the stores are stocked do not let me down TJ Maxx and Marshalls please give this video a big thumbs up if you guys are excited about shopping with me today and don't forget to subscribe it's the first link down below you guys know the drill tap the notification bell if you do not have your notifications on you will not know when i upload i do these every single week you guys don't want to miss out and let's go into store number one okay first thing we got is a skincare item and this is the kate somerville wrinkle warrior pink plumping mask we've been seeing a bit more kate somerville recently and this is $19.99 i noticed they also have the maybelline master fix um setting spray and this is $3.99 always gotta show off some drugstore finds too i found this marc jacobs make your lay mark three-piece travel size lip crayon set and this is $12.99. Been finding this one recently, the NARS highlighter in Albatross. This is $9.99. BH Afternoon Rendezvous 16 color eyeshadow palette. This is $6.99. Also found a lot of the Lash Boss Max from Laura Keller. This is $5.99. This palette is the Laura Keller Life Glows On Illuminator Trio. This is only $5.99. You get Diamond Dust, Opal Crush, and a French Fizz such a good set. They have the Algenus Color Correcting Radiant Primer. This is $9.99. One of my absolute favorite highlighters. This is the Smashbox Spotlight Pearl. I love this so much. $12.99. If you see this, grab it. It's so, so good. Tons of the White Peach Palette. This is $24.99. They have a bunch of those and they also have tons of the Peach Frost from Too Faced. This is $12.99. They also have a lot of the, I don't know what happened to that one, but they have a lot of the peach blur as well. This is $12.99. Okay, I also found the Pixie and Petra Hello Rose set. It has a glow booster illuminator, ba uh, blush and highlighter, and then a glossy lip pumper. So that's the packaging, and this is $7.99. Okay, this is awesome. I found this Marc Jacobs set. It's the Jeweled Eye Waterproof Eyeliner Volumizing Mascara Set. This is the Fall 2018 Runway Edition, and this is this is $29.99. So here's what you get inside. You get like a little pouch, an eyeliner, mascara. So that's a really cool find. I found this little mini Physician's Formula Spotlight Primer. This is $3.99. Let's see Cat Eye Ink Liquid Liner. This is $5.99. Um, I also found the Too Faced Glow Job Mask. This is the Glitter Mask. And this is $14.99. They do have the Gold Palette here on clearance for $10. I don't have this one, but the other formula is so good that I would also love to have the gold one too. Alright guys, so that store was okay. Not the best. They had some decent stuff a lot of good Marc Jacobs stuff which is really cool um so now I'm at Marshall shoe shop hoping it's not gonna be too crowded because it is Saturday and this parking lot is full so hopefully the makeup part is not like swarmed with people 
so I'm very excited. Let's go inside and see if we can find anything good. Okay, so the first thing I found is this NARS Sculpting Multi-Duo in Hot Sand and Laguna. So it comes in this like little stick and it's double-ended. So I guess you get one Hot Sand on one side and Laguna Bronzer on the other side. And this is only $12.99. Okay, they also have the Velvet Matte Foundation Stick. They have Santa Fe Medium 2 and Fiji Light 5. And this is $14.99. They also have the Laura Geller Baked Shadow Vivid Swirl Blush in Rose Water, and this is only $2.99. And this is Rose Water, super, super pretty color. It's like a bright coral pink. They also have this Laura Geller High Def Glow Illuminator Duo. This is only $5.99 in Heart of Gold. They also have the Laura Geller Beach Matte Baked Hydrating Bronzer in Siesta Medium. This is only $5.99. I also noticed they have some IT brushes this week. This one is double-ended. Looks like a brow and an eye brush, and this is $11.99. And this one, it's like a flat top and then an eye brush on the other side. This is $16.99. Okay, so this is the inside of the bronzer. It's so pretty. I like the pattern. It's the packaging. It's the packaging. They also have the Smashbox Be Legendary Lipstick in Mandarin. This is $7.99. Laura Geller Iconic Bake Sculpting Lipstick in Tribeca Tan. This is only $7.99. They have the NARS Audacious Lipstick for only $7.99 in a shade Live. And, and it is like a deep purple shade. They also have the Buxom Full On Lip Cream in Gin Fizz, which is such a weird color. It's like a white. don't really know what this is for. Maybe just like a lip topper, but this is only $5.99. Buxom Shimmer Shock Lipstick in... Flasher. It's color Flasher and this is $5.99. Jacob's they mark lipstick in the shade below and this is $7.99. Okay, here's a peek at the color. I think I found this a couple weeks ago. It's this little mini bite Amuse Bouche liquefied lip set. This is $9.99. They have these Smashbox Gloss Intuitive Lip Gloss and this is $9.99. It's like the one that changes colors according to your lip or changes colors when it's on your lips like the temperature and then you can see they have tons of the peach blur sweetie pie bronzer which i love peach blur i really honestly don't love it that much i just don't think it's that great of a product it just leaves this like weird peach cast on your face i'm interested in this it's the shea moisture sensitive skin cleansing oil with uh rose oil complex this is 5.99 i love cleansing oils and i go through them really quickly they have the saint tropez bronzing lotion self tan classic this is $16.99 they also have this algenus alive prebiotic balancing moisturizer and this is $19.99 they have this algenus hydrating essence toner this is only $9.99 giant bottle of clinique clarifying lotion too this is $19.99 Oh my gosh, I used to love this stuff. It's the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. This is $19.99. Pacifica Pore Refined Deep Detox Mask with Cactus, Strawberry, and Lemon Peel. This is $6.99. I found the Laura Mercier Flawless Skin Mega Moisture Cream. This is $24.99. The Saint Tropez Bronzing Mist. This is $14.99. And they have the Saint Tropez Everyday Tinted Moisturizer and Primer. This is... $11. I also wanted to show you guys this gorgeous ring. Isn't it so, so pretty? This is from a brand called Kate Sparkle. Um, look at that. Like when you move your hand, it sparkles so nicely. So obviously it's not a real diamond or anything like that. Um, and no, this video is not sponsored. They just sent this over to me and I wanted to show you guys. Um, the thing I love the most um, is actually this band underneath kind of like uh, an engagement band um, I do have my own set of course you guys know but um, I like wearing this one just to have a different style once in a while because I get bored very easily I like to switch it up I don't like wearing the same things every day so it's nice to have another kind of set on hand so this one I loved she has a few different styles I'm gonna link her page down below and she gave me a 30% off coupon code it's Kim and 30 so definitely check out her website she has like halo styles um, this style it's like an I guess an yeah I guess you would call this an oval and I just think it's so pretty the halo is super dainty and really thin um and i like that it kind of just accents the center stone and in real life if this is a real diamond this would probably be like 
two carrots or something. I don't know. It looks so big. I wonder if this actually fools anyone into thinking it's a real diamond. Like when you look at it and you compare it next to my real diamond, you can tell it's not a real diamond. Like I guess it's just cubic zirconia. Um, but here's a side view. It's also really pretty from the side and I just love the set together. I actually do wear this little band um, with my real set. I've been using it as my third ring to kind of complete the set and I love the way it looks. Really nice quality. Um, I'm wearing a size 5. I have a smaller like thinner kind of finger so I always have to get the smaller size and rings but I like how the band is really thin and it's just really pretty. When I opened it I was like oh my gosh this is so nice. Um, sometimes I do feel a little weird wearing it because I'm like I don't want people to think I have this like fake rock or something but honestly it's just for fun um, to wear around and pretend I have this huge giant diamond when it's actually really fake. Alright guys, so I am back. I took a little filming break. I had to go out and now I'm back and um, I wanted to, so I am at TJ Maxx right now and I wanted to show you guys I got a new wallet at Marshalls. It is so cute. It's fossil. I had to return a pair of shoes so I got the wallet instead of the shoes. The shoes were broken. I was so sad but it has a, a wristlet which is so important to me because I like bringing them into the store. Um, so yeah, that's what I got at Marshalls. Little quick little haul for you guys. Um, but I am at TJ Maxx right now hoping there's going to be some good stuff here. I forgot to tell you guys I'm actually shopping on a Saturday. This hasn't happened in so long but I really missed it because the stores are open so much later than on Sundays. Um, it's really late right now but I'm probably just going to shop through the rest of the night like till the stores close because I want to get all my filming done today so I can edit and then film whatever I have to film tomorrow because I'm super behind on my videos. So let's go into TJ Maxx. I'm sorry I'm so rambly and let's go see what they have. So the first thing I see is that the Vice lip kit from Urban Decay is marked down to only $3. So you get four shades in here, if you guys are interested in that. I also see they have a lot of the Laura Mercier Extra Lash, Lash Sculpting Mascara. This is $12.99. There's been a lot of e.l.f. recently. Um, this is the e.l.f. Natural Glow Lotion. And this is $2.99. I found a lot of these uh, about two weeks ago, the Lorac Alter Ego Hydrating Lip Stain. This one is only $3.99. And the shade is Headliner. Okay, there's more of these. I actually wanted to get one. Um, and I know a lot of you guys said that it was hard to get out of the pan. I think it's just very hard pressed in the pan. Um, but this is $16.89 and the shade is the shade is Casino. I think it's just more of kind of a lightweight kind of bronzer, like not so harsh. A few of the NARS highlighting blush powders and Albatross. This is a highlighter. And this is $9.99. Okay, so there's more of the NARS bronzers. So they have Casino. I don't know what this shade is because the sticker is blocking it. But these are all $16.99. I also found this Burberry, Burberry Cashmere Long Lasting Soft Matte Foundation. It's pretty interesting. It's $29.99 and the shade is Dark Sable. I think it's Dark Sable. Okay, in the skincare, they have the Palmer's Coconut Oil Facial Scrub. This is $3.99. And they have the Laura Mercier Candle Glow Soft Luminous Foundation. This is in Honey. This is $19.99. And then we have the Becca Evermatte Shine Proof Foundation in Tobacco. This is on clearance for $16. Alright guys, so I got a couple home things at that last TJ Maxx. And now I'm off to my next TJ Maxx. Thank God the stores are open later today. Um, I am burning the Budge Beauty Buys Midnight Oil. Um, so let's go on into the next store. I was debating going to Burlington, but I'm like, is it worth it? Not really sure, um, but let's go on and see what the next All right guys, so I went to a TJ Maxx, another one. Um, there isn't really any makeup here, but I did find a Dr. Jart Cheek and Eye Lift Hydrogel Patch, and this is $3.99. They also have the Peter Thomas Roth Firmex Peeling Gel. Love this. This is so good. This is, I have a little sample of this from some sort of box or I don't know where I got it from, but I can't find the price on this. This is really cool. Like you put it on and it literally takes off your dead skin. Like you see it. It's really cool. They also have the Too Faced Glow Job Radiance Boosting Glitter Face Mask. This is $14.99. Alright guys, I'm still going strong over here. The last store, oh my gosh, it was 
so bad. Like there was nothing. Um, but now I'm at my favorite TJ Maxx that I've been going to for a couple of months now and it's been my favorite. There's always good stuff here. So let's go inside and hopefully find some good Okay, the first thing I found is this Eyelore and Jasmine Brown collab eyelashes. And these were only $3.99. They also have the Laura Geller Easy Illuminating Stick for $5.99 in Gilded Honey. We have another one of the NARS Sunwash Diffusing Bronzers in Falossies, and this is $16.99. They also have the Urban Decay Afterglow 8 Hour Powder Highlighter in Sin, and this is $9.99. They have the NARS Velvet Matte Foundation Stick in Barcelona, this is $14.99. They have quite a lot of buxom lippy products here. They have the Shimmer Shock Lipstick in Pyro, and this is $5.99. And then they have the Buxom Lightweight Liquid Lipstick in Wondrous and Exhibitionist, and this is $5.99. Ooh, this is super pretty. They have the Laura Geller Easy Illuminating Stick in Diamond Dust, and this is only $3.99. And there is diamond dust it's a little hard to see because it's white but it's like a duochrome pink purple they also have the buxom lightweight liquid lipstick in devious dolly this is a 5.99 and then as you can see there's like an overload of the pixie chloe and dulce candy palettes um they also have the eye reflection eyeshadow palette this is $8.99 some lightweight liquid lipstick in Instigator, and this is $5.99. They, they also have the NARS Velvet Lip Liner in Ni Watu, this is $7.99. They also have these Living Proof sets, so you get the Perfect Hair Day Shampoo, Conditioner, and Styling Treatment, and this is $29.99. And then here's another living proof set. You get the full shampoo, conditioner, and thickening cream. And this is also $29.99. On this Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Spot Correcting Serum. This helps to brighten and tone. This is $5.99. I found this Glam Glow Water Burst Hydrating Glow Moisturizer. And this is $34.99. Look at that packaging. All right, guys. So that is going to do it for this week's episode of Budget Beauty Buys. I guys had fun shopping with me this week, and I do actually have a little giveaway. I've been meaning to do this for weeks because I've had this in here. In my car, um, I'm giving away a Juno & Co. microfiber angled contour sponge. It's that same material that um, is on all the other sponges, but I have so many of these because I think they accidentally sent me a package from that was supposed to be for another influencer. So I'm giving one away to one of you lovely gals or guys. Um, so if you wanna win this, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, that is definitely a rule. And also I wanna show you guys how stinking cute is this clip. I don't like um, turning to the side but how cute is that? I'm gonna link it down below. It was like $4 and I'm obsessed with it. It's so fun. There wasn't as many new items this week, so I was a little bit disappointed. Like there was a decent amount of new stuff, but I want like a lot of new stuff. You guys know I want the full mother load. Okay, my question of the day for you guys is if you could collab with any brand, what would it be and what would the product be? Let me know in the comments down below. I wanna do something a little all right guys, so that is gonna do it for this week's episode. I wanna do something a little bit fun and creative this week for the question of the day. I love hearing the responses from you guys and I love chatting with you in the comments. Um, so that is it. I love you guys so much. Thank you as always for coming along with me and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mwah.